So the first thing I'm going to do is prime my skin. It's the way I start my makeup all the time. It gives me a nice even base. And now I'm going to be using my NARS foundation in Syracuse. This foundation is very lightweight and sheer, uh, even though it's buildable. Moving on to the brows, I'm going to use my favorite brow pencil that I get from Dwayne Reed and this is Prestige brand and it's an earth brown. Using soft over paint pot, I'm going to define the bottom of my brow so that I get a nice base for my highlight and also uh, just defines the brow nicely. I'm also going to spread this onto my lid but not onto my crease. So using Quite Natural, it's a nice brown color, I'm going to apply this to my crease for the base of the colors that I'll be applying to the crease area. I'm using a MAC 217 brush to do so. And now moving on to my lid, I'm going to apply rice paper and it's just a nice champagne shimmery color. Um, you don't have to use these products, I'm just showing you something you can use as a guideline. And this is Brown Script by MAC and I'm going to apply this to my crease using that same 217 brush. Now to further define the crease, I'm going to use Max in Bark, and it's just this uh, deep brown, ready color. And I'm going to carve it out with the pencil brush, and then I'm going to apply more with a blending brush and just further define our new deep crease. Now for my liner, I'm going to use Maybelline's Color Tattoo in Blue on By and I'm going to just sketch out really quickly a nice dramatic wing liner that's going to outline the, the entire eye. this nice and bright and bold I'm going to use Sugar Pill Velocity eyeshadow it's one of my favorite favorite blue eyeshadows and I'm just going to pack this on top of that Maybelline color tattoo and this is going to intensify that blue and just make your eyes stand out put on some mascara as many coats as you like I put two all the time and then I'm going to apply lashes and um, I chose to use lashes just for like the outside corners to emphasize that wing cat eye and they are the Ardell's 305 this is your finished eye look I'm going to define my cheekbones because I have none <laughs> And this is a uh, Max Blunt, and now I'm going to highlight my cheekbones with a cream color base, and that's pearl. And for my blush, I chose NARS Orgasm. For the lips, I just chose to use Wet n Wild's 903C, which is a peachy color because peach and blue go so nicely together. And uh, yeah, just lined my lips with a natural lip liner, and this is Spice by Cinema Secrets. And then I topped it off with a lip gloss by MAC, and that is Peach Stock, which is limited, but I think you can still get it. Now I just wanted to show you guys how I styled my hair, and this is a very old twist out, and that's why I wanted to show you because this is the same twist out that I showed you guys and it lasts me a whole week. It could have gone longer but I wanted to wash my hair and um, yeah. Kudos to that Camille Rose Cranberry because seriously, I've never had a twist out last this long and look so good. For 
my new favorite accessory. These are the most beautiful earrings ever. I am obsessed. And uh, yeah, you should go get some because they're really affordable as well. I think I paid like $25. And this completes your look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up. Until next time, bye.